Hello there, so I just got done watching the change up, come out in 2011, done for about an hour and a half, an hour and 40 minutes, depending which version you watch, uh, the, the normal version or the extreme version, and it stars Jason Bateman and Ryan Reynolds, and uh, it's about these two friends, they've been friends since like they were kids, little kids, but they've kind of grown apart. And it starts off with like uh, the guy who's he's married and he's got twins and a little girl and uh, it's like he has to get up three in the morning and it's all a drag and oh my god oh my god like you know it's a whole big thing and then it goes to the other guy and he he's like you know the the big bachelor he doesn't have do anything he doesn't have he's a bit of a lazy slob but anyway and then they uh, finally the the meet up and they're like uh, they to have a few drinks and they're saying how each other's lives are so great and then the the pee in this big fountain out outside and and to say the wish to, to had each other's lives and then they wake up the mo next morning and they're each other and it's oh my god so like, so like the the panic for a few minutes, and then um, uh, and then it's like they really have to act like each other, like they have to uh, act like um, their friend, and it's it's some crazy wackiness happens, like you know some, but it basically the movies it's a real, I thought it was going to be like a chick flick kind of a thing but it's it's a real like movie made for men really because there's a lot of sex drugs uh male macho and there's a lot of fart jokes uh dick and ball jokes and there's a lot of people getting like you know hit uh in the in the balls and there's just like oh it's, it's just you know, it's just because it tries to be a normal movie, and then it goes, "Oh yeah, we have to, we have to do this, we have to do this, but we have to, we have to, we have to do." It. And it's just like, okay, yeah, it's not flowing easy, like you know, and it's like you know, uh, but to eventually um, to learn about each other's lives and to learn about uh, like what way to have it and the kind of wish they kind of had their own life back but then um start learning about themselves in their in their friends bodies like you know to, to listen to how people talk about them how people really think about them and it's really interesting you know to them and uh, they kind of realize uh who this should be and what this should be and um it's uh, interesting, like you know, to kind of grow up and that, like you know. But like, it's it's still, but mostly it's just a crazy, wacky movie, and there's a lot of uh, uh, it's, it's a lot of stuff happens that I don't think happens in real life. But like you know, it's a movie, so who cares? But um, but yeah, I'll give this film um, I'll give it a solid. 7 out of 10 because it is funny it was enjoyable but uh, like it, it, I think it dragged on a bit actually and um, certain places it dragged on a bit but uh, the kids the kids were funny a little girl was funny in it but um, the all of the co-actors were, were good in it as well and there was a few surprises like comedian surprises in it as well and um yeah that's about it um so that's it bye